There's always another thing to get better at, uh, whether it's cooking eggs or creating company policies. I understand that because I've been trying to cook the perfect poached egg for 20 years. <laughs> A little bit of vinegar. <laughs> okay. uh, yeah. Today I'm meeting with Christopher Kelly, president and co-founder of Convene. This chain of full-service meeting spaces integrates hospitality, design, food service, and technology to help on-the-go companies stay productive no matter where business takes them. What's the story behind Convene? How did you come up with the idea? My partner and I, when we entered the workforce, we were kind of almost confused as to why it looked so different than what we would build. Convene is taking services that would traditionally be found inside of a full service hotel, and we're introducing those into commercial workplaces and offices to transform uh, what it means to, to work in the modern economy. One of the things I noticed that you talk a lot about is this idea of having grit. So we, we define grit as passion and perseverance in pursuit of long-term goals because we are backing into a, a much larger vision for the company. You know, it's, it's an endurance sport, it's not a sprint. I know you're all into the long-term because you do a lot of triathlons, which is amazing, and I've read that you've compared training for a race, it, that it's similar in some ways to running a business. It, it's very similar. I, I think that if you're disciplined and deliberate in the way that you spend your time, then uh, that produces good results. And you know, the, the reason why I do the races is really just to keep me disciplined and on track with my training. It's the journey. It's the journey to get there, yeah. So training sounds a little bit like working, but you're saying it's not, right? <laughs> uh, well, for me, it's you know, work hard, play hard, and, and that goes into the play hard bucket for me. I know a lot of CEOs and founders, they tend to tweet about their company, but your Twitter messages are very different. You know, you're shining the light on other entrepreneurs. For me, Twitter is my personal notebook. I just make quick little notes uh, that then I go back and I reference uh, for my own personal use. And then if other people want to look in, uh, they're welcome to. If you think back to the early days when you were starting businesses, if there were things that you could do differently, what would they be? If I could look back and give myself some advice, it would be, you know, be less frustrated. It will all play out in time and really just enjoy every single day along the ride.